Howdy, and welcome to the Cartoon Quick Draw. I'm Mr. Dan, and in this episode, we're drawing a penguin. A dancing penguin. So the first thing we're going to need to do is we're going to draw a straight line. Just like that. This is going to be the top of its head, and we're going to draw another straight line going down at a diagonal. This is going to create the beak. We're going to go about halfway in between our, our long line. And on the other side, we're going to draw a round, like a, a backward C to close out the head. Now it's time to draw the body. What we're going to do is we're going to draw a giant U. We're just going to go out. We take it nice and slow and go to about there. Just one big U. At the end, we're just going to pull it down a little bit and that's going to be its tail, that little diagonal. And to close it out, we're just going to go from the head to the tail with a straight line. Now it's time to give it some features. First, let's give it a nice big eye by drawing a circle at the end and another one inside, nice and big. Now we're going to draw another backward C about halfway up and then we're going to draw a straight line from there to the top. And then right here at the end, I want you to draw a little T to show that he's happy. And we could put a dot there to show that he's got a nostril. Now penguins are black and white, so we're going to separate his body right now so we know which part is which. His belly's going to be white, and what we're going to do is we're going to draw almost like an oval. Like this is part of our oval, and we're just going to finish it off inside. So we're going to go up, around, and down. There's his belly. Now he's a dancing penguin, so that means he's got his feet moving. So we're going to draw one of his feet right here on his body. He's kicking it up. So the first thing we need to do is draw a big U. And then we're going to draw three U's on top to show his little toes. Just like that. Since we put that foot up, we need to put a foot down. Uh, down on the ground so we're gonna do the opposite of what we did here and we're gonna draw our U's just one two three just down like that now he needs his wings and we're gonna do teardrops so what we're gonna do is here at the base of the head we're gonna start we're gonna go out and then come back just like that and then we're going to do the same thing a little down from the line and we're going to go down and back to the same spot. Now since he's a penguin he's going to be black and white so we can go ahead and color him in using our marker. And uh, if you don't want to use your marker you're free to, to color him in with crayons or watercolors or however you like. If you don't want him to be a black penguin, you can make him purple or pink or green or blue because he's your penguin, so you're allowed to do whatever you want with him. Let your imagination run wild. And color in the wings as well. Alright, and there's our dancing penguin. Now I don't know if you've ever heard, but it's said that penguins wear tuxedos. So I'm going to dress mine up a little fancier. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a bow tie right here. I'm going to draw a square. And then from the corners, I'm just going to curve out. You can do it on both sides. And then just draw some sideway V's right there. And then on top of his head, I'm going to draw a hat. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start with a little smile. 
Then I'm going to go up with a rectangle, draw a line down at the bottom. That's it's going to be the band around the hat. You can color it red and color the bow tie red as well just to match it. Let's add a little shading down on this foot to show that he's still on the ground. And we're going to draw a few action lines right there right there just to show that he's moving as you can see we've got one happy dancing penguin